Hey, how's it going everyone? This is PD Pralat to come back with a Champions League final review. I said on my Facebook page and my Twitter page that I would uh, be doing a video of this game. And here we go. And which I've got to congratulate Barcelona for winning it 3-1. Unstoppable. Barcelona have been one of the deadliest teams in Europe this season. Like to prove to go and not beat by Munich in the semi-final to go through to the final was just amazing for them and congratulate to the manager Luis Enrique for getting them for making them get the treble this season as well would you believe so like they've won the Champions League they've won the league and they've won the Copa del Rey as well so it just shows how Barcelona how deadly they've been this season so here we go the first goal and um, Jordi Alba plays a long ball to Lionel Messi he then plays it into Neymar, and then he feds it through to Iniesta, and then he passes it to Rakitic, who just pretty much put it into an empty net. And there you go, 1-0 Barcelona. I mean, but that pass from Jordi Alba was just a oh, world-class pass, I thought, man. Just to get it in the messy and then oh, it was just phenomenal, that. What a, a counter-attack that was from Air Barcelona. But our Barcelona were looking quite controlling the game. Like, Juventus were pretty struggling, and I thought to catch to take Barcelona down like a lot of the time so and Barcelona could have added, probably added maybe a couple more I thought like Suarez on the right side and uh, plays it in and to uh, Dani Alves who shot on the edge of the box a uh, great save by Buffon to tip it over and uh, Messi, Messi give the ball to Neymar who just shot it over the boy should have really hit the target I thought uh, Neymar there but just before I get onto the second half of the game something that I thought was annoyed me I thought throughout this game Vidal he was lucky to be on the pitch I thought very lucky kid I thought like because think about it, he put in a few tackles which were bookable offences I thought especially like the first one I thought was a bookable offence and he got away with nothing for that and then um, the second one he does get a booking for it so it was probably right that he had his warning but he makes another tackle and then he slaps like Alves on the back of the head and you think of whoa so I think Vidal was a very lucky kid to stay on the pitch I thought how was he wasn't sent off I don't know but coming into the second half of the game and Juventus equaliser here we go Tevez gets the ball he's got the ball he shoots good save by the goalkeeper but he spills it out to Morata who puts it in for 1-1 and you're thinking oh could Juventus cause an upset like they did against Madrid to go through? And you're thinking, but my mind was still on Barcelona to win the to win this game. So, and here we go, right? Messi gets the ball on the left side. He runs all the way to it. He just shoots off the edge of the box. A good save by Buffa, but he managed to spill it out to Luis Suarez, who puts it in. I mean. What a time for him to get a goal in the Champions League final. And uh, there you go. Luis Suarez, as deadly as he can be as well as I've seen. Especially in these times in Liverpool. And he has been quite deadly as well for Barcelona. He has struggled a few times after for Barcelona. But that time. But when you're going to play with, uh, with Suarez, Messi and Neymar. You're thinking what a quality team you've got there. And it just shows how Barcelona have been. But here we go, right? The ball comes in and Neymar gets his head on it. It actually comes off his arm and into the back of there and it's apparently disallowed. Well, what do I think about this one, right? Um, it's not an intentional handball, so it, I would say it's probably a little bit harsh, I think, but someone has said like oh if it did didn't hit his arm if the coming off said it wouldn't have hit the back of the net anyway but i don't know i just think it wasn't intentional it wasn't a deliberate hard goal so i think it should have stood and i've seen goals like that being given before and i was just a bit disappointed that this was a uh, this was disallowed but it was a shame i didn't see messi get his goal today which would have been good but uh, then Suarez then comes off for Pedro and then here we go right the final third goal for Barcelona Messi's got I mean not Messi Neymar's got the ball 
He then gives it to Pedro, who did come on for Suarez. He gives it back to Neymar, finishes it off, 3-1, and Barcelona have won the Champions League. Right into stoppage time when it was past the five-minute mark, actually. But, but Barcelona said, we're not finished, we're just going to really kill this game off. They did that. And I've got to say, great Champions League final. And I've got to say, congratulations to Barcelona as well for getting the treble, as I've said. Especially to get Messi, Neymar and Suarez playing with each other. It just shows how what how they can really rip past teams, destroy teams, when you've got those three playing on the pitch. But it's also Xavi's last game for Barcelona as well. I wish the kid good luck to his next club he goes to. But 17 years he's been there, Xavi, and you've got to say he's been an amazing player for them as well. As you said, wish him to the next club he goes to. 17 years, would you believe he's been at Barcelona for? Four. Hey man, I remember Newcastle in the Champions League at that time and Xavi was playing for Barcelona there as well. <laughs> but Barcelona I thought were well deserved when, especially in the first half, they were way better team. I thought a lot of the time. Juventus had a couple of good chances. I know Marquisio had a decent one in the first half as I forgot to mention before, sorry about that, but just took that over the bar, but was it, it just like the struggled a lot of the time, I thought, like Vidal was lucky to be on the pitch, as I've said before, why wasn't he sent off, I don't know, but that's football finish for now, that's all the Europe, I think we've got England coming up next, I think, but that's like all the European teams, all the other football, just international has got to play now, but... Oh well, let's tell you what we'll see, look forward to the next season. I hope you've enjoyed my Champions League final video review. I said I would do it, and I did. So I hope I've made just happy of doing that. So I've uh, also been enjoying a nice bit of red wine tonight just for a change. So. <sighs> Lovely red wine. No. <laughs> so as I said, I hope you enjoyed. If you want more videos, get subscribing if you want to. Uh, like, comment as well. Uh, like my Facebook page, uh, PD Prowlock. Also, follow us on Twitter if you want to, and give me some tweets if you want on PD Prowlock as well. As I said, hope you enjoyed. And congratulations again to Barcelona. I'll see you all later. Take care.